those guys came off the bench. Bird, uh, they started, but you had to like the the contributions that you got from not just one or two, but like six or seven guys. Yeah, you know, it was it was good balance, and you're trying to to get eleven guys in there and also play kind of the style. I mean, they had some very athletic combo forwards, and. Um, you know, you know they're going to run and jump a little bit and do some different things that they didn't do in the first half. And they hadn't played that much zone. He went straight to a zone after we've shot the ball well right. in previous games. And so now, uh, when that happens, you know, you, you kind of settle for you know too many jump shots. Now, if you're making them, um, they're they're in trouble because they went to something and now it doesn't work. But um, we settled for jump shots, and anytime we got our dribble inside. Good things happen for us, but we just we, we pass it around the perimeter too much against their zone, and it got us a little bit stagnant, and we, we settled for those shots. But I, I think we got you know a lot of depth, and it's it's going to be a different look I think each time out you know with our opponent, and you don't go into it thinking I'm going to play these guys more than the next day. You just kind of wait and see who plays well, and they kind of get more minutes. But you know I, I thought we had a lot of guys step up. I was proud of Ryan Smith. Um, you know he doesn't start. And uh, he doesn't pout. He goes out there and gets something done. And he played well for us today, and that's what we need. Whether he starts for us or he doesn't, he needs to be a threat out there on the court and, and make some shots. And uh, I was proud of him for, you know, for being positive and, uh, and then playing his best game so far this year. That's a good example for others, isn't it, to see that. I mean, here's a guy who starts your first three games, doesn't start. Right. Instead of, like you said, he doesn't pout, comes in, he hits three huge threes when you really need. Yes, and that was something, you know, when they went to that zone and he came in and made those shots, we really needed that, um, you know, at that time. So um, he's done a good job for us. He's a, he's, a, he's a good guy and he works hard and he wants to see Purdue win. Your two points, I thought, together and doing different things, yet collectively had a nice uh, nice night for you. Yeah, you know, uh, you know, Kelsey, you know, can get going and you know, he'll play hard. He's emotional, uh, yeah. but, but he, will, he will play hard and, and that's something that, you know, we really value when he comes off the bench. I don't think he quite gets the credit for how hard he plays when he goes out there. And he, he really does a good job of competing and laying it on the line. And then Lou, you know, he had the you know, the two turnovers there um, when they went to the kind of the zone press. Um, but Lou did a good job for us. You know, nine assists and um, probably should have had four or five more. You know, we had some point blank layups from some big guys um, that they didn't convert. And uh, Lou talked about it at the timeout <laughs> with some of those big guys. You know, he's. He's delivering the basketball, and you know they're missing, you know, layups, and something we got to do a better job of when we're at the rim of just finishing. Matt, you always said about Chris Kramer, he was better when he was on edge. I, I don't want to compare Kelsey to Chris because they're completely different, but it, can you say the same thing about Kelsey? Like when when he takes a chippy foul or something like that and kind of gets mad, he yeah, turns it up yeah. a little bit. You know, very uh, few guys get mad and actually get more productive. You know, most times when guys get mad, it goes the other way, and. Um, and as long as Kelsey, you know, can control that, um, he's normally productive after he gets mad. I like it from a defensive standpoint. Sometimes when he, you know, he gets to that point where he's gets chippy um, offensively, you know, he'll jump over the fight. But you know, from a defensive standpoint, you know, he does a very good job of just continuing to play hard and try to pester those guys. Just uh, how important. Was